Hey y'all, had to get that post-workout meal. As y'all seen, I went and stopped, got some hot dogs and burgers there, you know, cooking by the by the pools. And uh, as you see in the next clip, those little animals pretty much, they see my food. because so I was just trying to get a recording of them for the, for the video and the uh, content. And they pretty much, they see my food. And as I was recording, they pretty much just rushed me. So as you see now, I was backing off to see <laughs> what type of time they was on, but, uh, yeah, they, they just wanted, I guess, you know, some of my food and stuff, but so I mean, I made it out of there, you know what I'm saying? So I gotta, I gotta get my, my gains, you know what I'm saying? Trying to get back in shape, like I said, so, uh, didn't have to eat at the, uh, the grill or whatever, but, um, definitely was just convenient real quick, um, and smelled real good. So definitely wanted to try it out. Buffet was still open and one of the restaurants were open. Actually, I think two restaurants were open. Um, but yeah. Definitely about to eat this uh, shower and then hit the hit the beach and then maybe get in the pool a little bit, relax. But yeah, get some drinks and, and just vibe. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. Finally about to hit the beach. It's a quick look at the, the fit, real basic. You know what I'm saying? I'll probably get my feet wet a little bit in the ocean a little bit, you know, and, uh, and then go uh, chill by the pool and probably swim a couple laps, get that cardio in. Uh, I know I get a lot of questions uh, a lot about my uh, my tattoos, so um, I'm thinking about making a, a separate video of those uh, one of these days. Uh, definitely let me know if that's something you guys are interested in seeing. Um, but yeah, I'm about to head down there. Probably get another little flick for y'all, and uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how it is out there. It's, it's still obviously real nice out there sun shining and there's really no clouds so yeah and uh side note big fan of uh nike so nike if you're seeing this hey get your boy a you know sponsorship or something i'm always rocking you guys stuff my sons are too so give me a call information is below all right y'all peace all right y'all so y'all real quick walk to the beach real quick want to point out right behind me that hut there uh that's where they're gonna set up the uh, kayaking, snorkeling, all the little events you might want to do while you're out here. Obviously the bar is right there. So yeah, just gonna get a quick uh, beach chair, lounge out for a minute. Check out how cold this water is. I might tell y'all right now if it's cold or not. Let's check it out. here in the Caribbean. A lot of seaweed. It's not something I'm swimming in here, so I think it's a big deal. It's a little cold. Not bad though. Not too bad. Actually feels pretty good. Feels real good. Sand is real soft out here. Definitely, definitely liking it. over there under the umbrellas. There's a lot of seaweed, like I mentioned, but uh, yeah, I don't know if you guys can't see the phone, but uh, you can't see the difference in colors. Like right up here, you can see it's kind of brownish because of the seaweed, but then you see the turquoise color a little further up and then the dark blue, you know, being deeper in the sea and everything. But yeah, definitely, definitely a dope vibe out here. Perfect time to be out here just, just to relax. All I need, all I need. Y'all hit me up with questions, man, and definitely get to answer them. Definitely a lot, a lot I want to put out there, and I can really help as many people as I can, and it is my, my purpose, you know what I mean? Alright, y'all, my You see a lot of my, my airpods in it. Skyrockets from here. Appreciate y'all.
lot of staff just came up to me and told me about uh, one of the 11 uh, restaurants they had out here. I didn't know they had 11 restaurants until just now. But he told me this one has real good seafood. Um, it's right on the water. It's called Chill Out. So anyway, as you eat, you can you know, watch the water and everything. And, and uh, I think he, I didn't ask him, but I'm pretty sure uh, you can see Cozumel, the island over there. Some of the buildings, if I can see what's going on with cell phone, but definitely, definitely cool to see. I, I know you can catch ferries over there and spend a whole day doing you know, ATV riding and some cool little activities and stuff. And, yeah, I just wanted to throw that out there real quick. Uh, so it's all here vibe. So oh, don't forget, I'm probably going to check out that chill out restaurant. You see if you're going to make me a reservation. So maybe going to uh, record that, document that too. Yeah.
Stay in the resort, you know, stay local, you know. Uh, that's how resorts are, you know, they're built, you know, they pretty much get everything all in the uh, area. So you don't really have to go outside of the resort. That's their goal is to keep you here, you know. So like I said, they, they kept me here and like I said, I'm not complaining, you know, I'm just trying to relax. And they had a little shows last night. Like I said, I was just by the bar, just, just vibing after the, uh, the hot tub. Definitely a good vibe. Um, I think for the most part, I covered the majority of the resort. So um, I probably won't be uh, recording too much more for the resort for this video. Um, but if you guys have any more questions, I'll definitely be uh, able to answer them. Um, Sitting here, about to eat breakfast at the uh, Platinum Exclusive uh, Snack Breakfast Building. Definitely surprised. I uh, didn't think they're gonna have the variety, the same variety that the uh, main lobby, or the main buffet had, but they do. Um, definitely great. Yeah, about the same stuff I did yesterday, if not more. Um, everything looks really good. Hey, y'all, before I get uh, totally situated, just want to run over the uh, pricing of everything. Like I said, it's all inclusive, so that includes the drinks and the food primarily. Um, some of the restaurants you may pay extra if you ask for like lobster, or shrimp, things like that. Um, but yeah, for the most part, if it's just the general food buffet and uh, the food trucks and everything, that's all included and drinks all included. Um, as far as my stay, uh, like I said, in the beginning of the video, the reason I actually, you know, chose to come out here was because it was uh, cheap. Um, the original uh, standard price for a room was 83 a night. Can't beat that. Um, and then, like I said, you upgrade to platinum, it became like 108. So, still very good. Um, but yeah, as far as the prices for the excursions and you know doing ATVs, going to Cozumel, uh, Chichen Itza. Uh, you know, going to Tulum or, you know, Cancun, doing uh, X Carrot, uh, Echo Park, all those range from around, <clears throat> excuse me, all those range from around uh, $100 to $150, um, 
just depends on what I guess package you choose. Um, not bad price and, and they're well worth the money. Um, but yeah, and then as far as prices for taxis, they seem to now have a set system. Um, for the most part, like from different hotels, they have uh, downtown uh, in Playa a uh, pretty much grid or uh, uh, algorithm they go off of on this uh, laminated uh, paper, pretty much explaining which hotel they go to and then which price. Everything seems pretty standard because I know for the most part, if you watch other YouTubers uh, that um, documented their, their travels out here, they said to always you know, kind of bargain with the uh, taxi drivers because they will try to start high and then you can get them down low. But it seems like now they kind of got a standard, you know, price or, what, or rate what they expect. Um, so yeah, just to shoot that out there, like I said, hey, definitely ask more questions. Um, but yeah, this was uh, this was good. Um, I think I covered just about everything. Like I said, if I am missing something, please ask and I will get you that information, y'all. But yeah, let's get started. So good. I'm gonna try this raccoon and I'll show you a quick snippet of the uh, steak and uh, 
exercise and stuff like that. But yeah. Good. Yeah, y'all just finished the uh the meat clean soup. Pretty good. The meat was uh fatty and the soup was good. I had uh my main man uh, Ezekiel bring me out some more of uh, that shrimp man, so it was just that fire. He said they ain't you're only supposed to kinda of give out just uh, one, you know, her meal. But I said he's I guess they just they like me. I'm not complaining, so definitely gotta give my main week a good tip. Man. Steak should be here in a couple minutes, they say. So. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely fun, man. Alright, y'all. Main course finally got here. Got my uh, steak, uh, creamy spinach, baked potato, uh, mac and cheese on the way. So, just real quick. Bringing me a little clean grid. Uh, sorry about being so quiet. I just re watched some of these uh, past little clips I just recorded and realized I'm pretty quiet in the audio. But uh, it's kind of like a more formal restaurant. So, not that you gotta be like dressed up or anything. Some people are, you know, kind of formal dress, collar shirts, and stuff like that. Me, I'm, I just took my wife's and they let me in uh, with that. I pretty much brought all white tees. I got like six white tees I brought. So. I got my formal dress too for like some of the clubs I put on checking out, but like I said, I the uh, southern business right here, if they want to turn me around, I just went to the room and changed real quick, but they said they in white too, so excuse me, no, no complaints, but yeah, I'm gonna get this main course in my belly and uh, I'll catch y'all later. Activities and events that you can do. Uh, most of them are about five hours to an all-day type of event. Uh, you can do the ATVs and uh, zip lining uh, and snorkeling and a couple other different things with uh, Tulum, also with uh, Cozumel, the island uh, that you can take a ferry to, and then you can also go ahead and visit uh, the island of. Uh, is La Mujeres and definitely go check out the uh, beautiful waters out there, the snorkeling and the uh, rituals they have out there because that island is dedicated to, uh, I guess, the women of the uh, Mayan um, culture. Um, but yeah, definitely out here enjoying the waters right now. I'll keep out here swimming today. Yeah, I'm just uh, getting my feet wet a little bit and then going, having lunch right on the, the water out here. They made tacos, I'm going to show you guys that in a bit. Uh, and they get, give us some more drinks, of course. Beautiful day, it's been a beautiful day every day. I just want to make sure I give you guys a uh, better update. I might, I might have to answer some questions to elaborate more on the uh, 
activities and events they do have out here. But yeah, I hope uh, you guys really enjoyed this video. Um, like I said, definitely ask questions if you do have them, and I'll be sure to answer them. And yeah, um, like I said, it's my, my first video. Hopefully it's not my last. I hope you guys enjoyed it enough to where I can keep going. Uh, feel motivated to do more for y'all. And uh, yeah, like I said, I want to thank the most high for just the opportunity to be out here. And thank you for my kids and my family for inspiring me to do things like this. And yeah, it's definitely a blessing, you guys. I think a blessing. I don't know if you guys can see all the way out there. The jet ski. I'll be racing. I might, might try to do that. They got the staff out here cleaning up as much seaweed as they can. They should do a damn good job. Shout out to these guys. So as you can see, you really can't see that much seaweed on the beach. As you've seen, I think day one, day two. Yeah, it's, it's beautiful. Tacos real quick. Okay, y'all back under my umbrella. Just want to show y'all tacos real quick. They had chicken, steak, pork. Definitely had to dive in those. A little strawberry daiquiri and chrono, of course. Already had a couple of those, but yeah. Just sitting back, catching the vibe as usual, listening to my music. But yeah, right here they got the uh Massages right on the, the water. Definitely move there too. Ultimate relaxation. The guys, like I said, just drop the questions in the in the bottom in the comment box. And I'll get you guys answered. All right. shout out like I did Nike earlier um, like I said definitely looking forward to uh, getting some endorsements or sponsorships but uh, another uh, app I do like as far as investing in you know stocks shares and slices is a app called uh, public um, one second what did you order? Uh, the two uh, strawberry daiquiri Yes. I bring one. One. When I come back, and I make okay. the first one. Okay, thank you. I thought y'all, um, but yeah, them, and then obviously you see throughout the video, I've probably been playing with these little <coughs> hairs around my chin strap here. Definitely need this thing to fill in. I know uh, there's apps and, um, uh, product under like uh, beer club and some other uh, folks but yeah you guys can tag them shout them out man tell them send me some stuff uh, I think I've used beer club before and I think it does work for real I just haven't been uh, consistent um, but yeah you know what I'm saying get them tagged in here whatever else you guys think I might need like I said definitely trying to uh, help others if I can and just improve myself as I go all right y'all
all sitting poolside now. Pretty much almost fell asleep uh, by the beach. Now I'm at the pool. Uh, as you've seen, they got the games and activities going on. Uh, I think the first time I've seen the games, one of the girls won like some cash, cash prize. This time uh, the girl won, uh, the one from Canada, she won uh, Coco Bongo uh, ticket entrance and I think like a bag and stuff like that. Uh, definitely pretty cool. Uh, and I think the girl from the US, like I said, uh, she won the cash yesterday. But uh, yeah, definitely cool to see um, all the different countries that are out here. They always ask, you know, where you're from and what's your name and you get to see that, you know, there's definitely a variety of people out here, very diverse. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'm just sitting poolside, um, pool closer to my subdivision. Gonna have uh, a couple other games here start shortly. Uh, so water, uh, volleyball, and water polo. Um, and you guys in the beach volleyball, they got that over there. And some other activities, like I said, we're pretty much not too far from the beach uh, right now. But uh, yeah, definitely, definitely nice to be in the shade as I was when I was on the beach. Hard to find the shaded. Uh, Lounge chairs, they definitely get taken up fast, so you gotta be quick. Um, get here early if you can. Um, yes. Definitely feeling good out here. So we got, they got ping pong as well, chess, plenty of games for the kids, footballs they can throw around. Yeah, it's definitely, definitely a good vacay. Good spot, and so questions please ask. Uh, I'm here for y'all. Definitely trying to do more. All right, y'all. Listen to some more tunes. And then see what we're going to do tonight. Yeah, it should, should tie into the uh, end of uh, the resort uh, video. So if you guys got questions, definitely shoot them my way. One.
commentary on the, uh, the restaurant clips you guys just seen so with the miso restaurant they are separated in three different restaurants uh, and you gotta make reservations for whichever one you choose whether it be the sushi one that you guys seen the hibachi and then there's the oriental um, or I think it's Thai um, but you have to choose which one you want and then you book a reservation I was lucky enough to, uh, I chose the sushi one initially, and I was still hungry after I ate the sushi. And then I went over uh, and asked the like head uh, <coughs> concierge or hostess. Uh, I asked if I could order, just order, and not even sit at the hibachi table. And he said he, he just you know wanted me to sit down, gave me a seat. As you guys seen in the video, uh, food was good, uh, both sushi and the hibachi. Uh, and you guys seen the. Uh, quick little videos of the Italian restaurant. <clears throat> Didn't know anything until today when I walked around more where I seen the, uh, the sports bar, uh, got some drinks in there. Uh, definitely a nice vibe. Um, and then there's the casino. Uh, there's more stores um, that are open. Uh, and there's a couple of the restaurants I haven't really seen. I know I kind of gave you a quick snippet earlier uh, of the um, chill out restaurant and I, I know I ate there the first time but I didn't get no uh, recordings their food's good uh, I was gonna try to eat there again actually but they actually have no wedding there tonight um, but yeah overall like I said uh, Grand Riviera uh, Sunset Princess definitely 10 out of 10 would recommend uh, for families solo travel couples everything definitely a good time good time um, but yeah like I said this honestly will uh, wrap up just about my full experience and review of the hotel the resort um like i said i definitely had a great time uh i appreciate you guys uh grand rivera princess if you guys are watching definitely appreciate you guys i want to say just thank you to you guys to all staff um had a great time i appreciated my stay uh and yeah i mean honestly that's that's about it for this uh video i want to definitely shout out you know my family my kids especially they inspire me and you know, all praises to the most high as usual. Uh, wouldn't be here out without him. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, like I said, if you guys got any questions, definitely shoot them my way and I'll be sure to answer them. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you guys, you know, motivate and inspire me to do more for y'all. Cause I, I definitely had a lot of content I could provide. And I think I could really, you know, enter, you know, uh, a new realm of, you know, leveling up myself and, hopefully, you know, reaching new pinnacles, you know? So yeah, like I said, just, just trying this out for now. And, you know, I think if I really find this is my passion, then I'll, I'll go ahead and really jump, you know, full force into it. So, but yeah, you know, if you guys got any uh, recommendations, any uh, pro tips of, of your own um, and, you know, advice, I'm definitely here to hear that as well. Cause I'm just a beginner. Uh, so yeah. Uh, I'll see you guys soon, all right?
relaxation. Got my tacos again. Um, yeah, it's definitely been a great trip. Definitely feel recharged. I feel motivated, if anything, to definitely do more things like this. Uh, yeah, so I know I got some videos of uh, a tour of Chichen Itza and down, downtown uh, Playa. So I plan on actually separating those videos so you guys can, you know, view them uh, if you wanted to, you know, see either or instead of just bulking it all in one video. So yeah, I just gotta get to working on those. And yeah, if you guys wanna see them, uh, like I said, they'll be up. Uh, and if you wanna see more, if you got questions, let me know. I'll be sure to answer them. Um, but yeah, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed everything. Um, I definitely enjoyed my time here and I always wanted to, you know, give the praise to the most high and just say I'm extremely uh, grateful and uh, thankful for this opportunity. And yeah, um, I want to show off my, my shorts and everything. Uh, so definitely was not here being too flashy. Everything was pretty comfortable, but yeah, I definitely got uh, a lot of fits and stuff I could show off too. Um, different swim trunks uh, and beach attire. Um, yeah, spent a lot of time on an island uh, before, so I'm always ready to go to the beach. Um, but yeah, if you guys got questions about anything, I mean anything, definitely let me know. Uh, yeah, like I said, I'm gonna make more videos depending on what you guys wanna see. Whether it be tattoos, you know, kids, family time, uh, military, traveling, anything. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do anything, everything. But uh, yeah, like I said, this pretty much ties up the Grand Rivera uh, Sunset Princess uh, Resort uh, feedback and um, my experience here. Um, but yeah, definitely, uh, definitely a uh, good time. All right, y'all. That's a wrap. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Definitely will need it. Music, hot tub, beautiful. Definitely a good way to end a night, perfect nightcap. If it's the end of the night for you, you know. Um, definitely feeling relaxed right now. Definitely wanna, uh, again, just say, hey, you know, take care of yourself. You know, uh, self-care. No one's gonna take care of you better than you, so. Definitely get out there and do what makes you happy. Whatever that is, you know, whatever you do for self-care, as long as you ain't hurting nobody else, by all means, do what you gotta do. Because if you can't take care of yourself, you can't take care of others. A lot of us got responsibilities out here, so. Definitely, you know, put yourself in a, in a position where you're gonna, you know, take pride and take care of yourself and just taking time off to appreciate all your accomplishments and everything like that definitely take time to pat yourself on the back because a lot of times other people won't do it you know but yeah so i just got my little robe on right now <sighs> definitely sweating a little bit that hot tub was hotter than i needed it to be but like i said it was definitely definitely relaxing that's all i want to do out here that's all i've been doing but yeah, y'all, I'm gonna have a closing clip uh, coming up. Just wanted to, you know, just hopefully show you guys that I am out here relaxing and hopefully inspire you guys to do the same thing. All right? So yeah, definitely, definitely self-care, recommend. says you would need your vaccination card but I didn't have to show mine once so we can do that uh do with that information as well. Um 
And as far as departing from Mexico back to the States, you do need uh, your negative uh, test results. Um, you take the antigen test, which is uh, going to be 30 minutes for you to get your results, and then the PCR test will take up to 12 hours to a day. So plan accordingly. You can get tested at your hotels, at the resort. You can do it at the resort I was at. And you can also do it at the airport. So just so you guys can take.